can I do for you, Mr. Hightower? Well, I was wondering if you could loan me 20 bucks. I promise Cedric I pay him back today. Why are you so broke? Well, you know that little polite Arthur Rabinowitz? He put me on a budget. And I kind of spent all my pocket money on a pair of Porsche sunglasses this month. Hey, y'all. I'm glad y'all both here. I have something kind of personal to talk to y'all about. It's about mine and Sadie's love life. Oh, Lord. Did the little born again boy catch y'all in the copy room again? Ever since Sad got nominated for that Teacher of the Year award, he don't want to. Uh, Levita, it's okay. We get the picture. Oh, Cedric, you know, I, I wish there was something we could do to help him win, but I'm afraid we'll just have to wait on the results, whatever they are. Well, I know he'd feel a whole lot better if I gave him back that 20 that he was gonna let me have. Fine. Here's your 20. I'll take it out of your paycheck. Oh, no, no, please. Please don't do that. Little Arthur, he'll find out about that. He'll make me take my sunglasses back. I look way too good in them sunglasses. You want to see us, Coach? Yeah. I got those Bears tickets, I promised you. Ah! Coach, you're the best teacher in this school. You're the only one who keeps his word. Yeah, man. Well, except for the shop teacher. He said he was going to chase us with a hammer. And he did. <laughs> Say it, you ain't going to believe what just happened to me. Or it's supposed to be somewhere? No, not really. Like you said, Mr. Hightower, we go win nowhere. <laughs> oh, l l l let's go, Bullethead. He don't appreciate our humor. <laughs> what happened, dog? Did Showtoon Boy leave you another plate of brownies? <laughs> no, man. I just got disqualified from my nomination as Teacher of the Year over some technicality. What technicality? Oh, you know, I got disqualified for that, that 90210 route. I just got disqualified. Oh, good, you're both here. Look, I just want to bring you your invitations for the reception for the Teacher of the Year nominations. Oh, that's very insensitive, Regina. I mean, how can you come in here flashing invitations when you know Steve has been eliminated? What are you talking about? You you know that rule that I got disqualified for, the 9-11-400 SL rule? The one that leaves the field wide open for Cedric? Oh, yeah. That, oh, that's a bad rule. Oh, I hate that rule. You know, but uh, the, the rules are, are the rules, so... Sorry, Steve. You're out. It just doesn't seem right. I mean, isn't that something you can do? Well, okay. Look, Steve, you can come to the reception, but you just can't eat until all of the nominees have had seconds. Well, you know, you really got a big heart, Regina. That's why I always stand up for you in the teacher's lounge when some of the other teachers start to saying that you wouldn't be so cranky if you had a man. 